It's time to review everyone's favourite Russian bear, it's Ursa Major. Hey guys, me host Supersaur, thank you very much for tuning in, and look what I got, it's Ursa Major. So here he is guys, the bath figure from the wave, the one you've all been waiting for, the big bear himself. He is an absolute monster of a figure guys, and I'm really impressed with it. They've done some great detailing on this. Uh, to make him look like a, a big a big grizzly bear, basically. And, yeah, I think a lot of people have been impressed with this figure. Um, it's really come together very nicely. Um, they've given it some additional um, articulation, which I like as well, which we'll go over. Um, and the, I think the paint apps and the way they've made him look actually, like, made him look hairy and stuff is very good. Very detailed, and I love it. So what I love about this figure is, is the articulation, it's got so much, so the head can move left and right. It can look up and down a little bit, but not too much. The arms do lift up at this side hinge and do also rotate, the rotation at the biceps and the single hinged elbows. And the hands bend quite far as well, just like a bear's would, which is brilliant. Uh, you can also actually bend him at this waist point. They've actually added another um, hinge on here, so you can rotate him left and right, like that. So he actually hinges off the body, which is nice, and that also means you can pull him back to the front and then go forwards and backwards as well, which is pretty good. Gives him plenty of articulation to hunch him over a bit more bear-like. I tend to have him stood up quite tall, but you can really hunch him up. The legs also have top thigh cut, there's uh, single hinge knees, and the feet are on rocker and pivots. I love the big claws that they've included and the little paw prints and things. They've, they've really gone to town on this bear. Uh, it's not just like some of the other bath figures where you've had that just made it look like that. It feels like they've really gone out of the way to sculpt the light, the likeness of a bear, which is brilliant. Um, not sure what I'm going to do with him, my collection-wise. Um, he's brilliant, and but I, I just I don't have the rest of the figures other than Dark Star to put with him, so I might end up uh, moving this onto a better home who might enjoy him a little bit more. But. It is such an awesome figure. It's definitely one that I think Marvel has spent a lot of time uh, scra you know, put, put, putting together for us, and you can definitely tell. Loving all the paint apps and things. They're really well done. I can't see any issues with it whatsoever. He is an absolute beast of a figure. If I had the, the other bath figures to hand, I would do some comparisons, uh, but I don't actually have them as they're currently in uh, storage, you know, right now. Going through a bit of transition with the channel in the room and stuff. Um... But either way, the figure is absolutely really well put together. It's great painted, sculpted, and he, he really can stand. Some bath figures I find feel very clunky. This guy actually feels very dynamic. He, as long as his paws are completely flat down, um, the, the big feet with the big long nails tend to ground him really well. Um, I haven't actually had him fall over once yet, and he's very top heavy. Look. As you can see, he's leaning forward, but it, it takes a lot for him to go. So as long as these paws... Like that, a flat. He is going nowhere, hopefully. <laughs> Normally I say that and then the fall. But yeah, he's going nowhere. A great figure. And I really recommend grabbing one for your collection, guys. But what are your thoughts on this bath figure? Let me know in the comments down below. If you have enjoyed watching this series of short reviews, then please let me know. And when I get a wave in the future, I can do loads of short reviews like this again. And just thank you very much for watching. So as always, I'm your host, Soup Sorrel, and I'll see you in the next video. And until then, may the force be with you.